Good morning, it's day two on the Camino. Just left the hotel. It's like 9.30 a.m. I maybe got three hours of sleep. It was rough. I'm not the whole time zone difference uh, jet lag thing got me. But we had an amazing stay. If you can do the 17 miles, I highly recommend you staying at Hotel Burgett. There's Heather. Hi. It's a little chilly today. Probably like 50 degrees, 49. It feels cold though. So we're just starting. We're probably going to be doing around either 17 or 21 miles because we're only 24. Look how nice the house is. Uh, we're only 24 miles to Pamplona. But it doesn't make sense to get there late in the evening and then have to leave the next day. So we want to get there kind of in the morning and check the city out. We want to get some SIM cards so we can use phones here. And yeah, should be a good day. All right, let's go. Coming out of Burget, it's really quick walk through town and just take a quick sharp right. Uh, there's arrows on the floor, but I know lots of people miss it. I remembered that from someone else's video. Uh, yeah, so don't do that. Turn right. Now we're going through all these cow farms. Really beautiful. You know what this song could use? A little more cowbell. This kind of reminds me of on the Appalachian Mountains, they have uh, mountain laurel. Kind of looks like that. Beautiful. Uh, free hugs in there. Cloudy, misty. This is so pretty. Uh, there's a road up here on the left, but um, so we're about only three miles in, I think. Um, we walked through another town and then lots of farmlands and just got into this beautiful forest. But yeah, doing great. I uh, just had a really good break, like second breakfast. Uh, we're five miles in, taking our time today, but it's nice. And it's noon and we only have 12 miles left, which we think we'll stop there at 17 miles for the day. And that would leave only like six miles into Pamplona. I'm excited to go there. All right. Pandemonium in the streets. About, I don't know, six, seven miles in? I don't know. Uh, so far, there's been some climbs. Uh, not too steep, but I don't know, 400, 500 foot climbs are just enough to be annoying. But yeah, it's been beautiful so far. This is my Camino dog. <laughs> Just starting the mile and a half, I think, uh, descent into Zabiri. It's pretty rocky. Um, 
yeah, I just wanted you guys to see the trail. It's not all like smooth paved uh, trail or roads. Um, a little bit technical actually, if you've never hiked before. Uh, I always have my trekking pole, at least one, but I'm clumsy. Not saying you necessarily need one to do the Camino, but I, I just prefer it. Um, yeah, I almost fall at least once or twice a day and trekking pole helps me. All right. Um, I want to have to Sibiri. We'll have lunch there and take a little break. Then do a few more miles to get that 17 mile day in. Um, so far, it's been very beautiful. There's been tons of people, uh, but we've passed everyone that probably started in Ronce Valles early in the morning. So past, I don't know, 100 people probably, 75. But they're all, everyone's really nice. And people are already starting to know me. And uh, it's, it's kind of funny when people start screaming out your name or saying, oh, Puerto Rico. Because, you know, so many different countries here. So that's fun. And yeah. All right. See you later. Just made it to Zabiri. Uh, that downhill is pretty steep, very rocky. Uh, very Appalachian Trailish like descent, very steep. Um, yeah, trying to get some food now. This lady right here, I call her Wonder Woman. She's very strong and she hikes. I heard my yesterday. Here we are, same same town, coming in at the same time. Uh, beautiful old Roman bridge. Um, see where we can get some food. That's Zubiri behind me. Just had really good lunch, and we have four five point five left, and we'll finish our. 17 mile day. Been a really good day. Met so many interesting people. Really good conversations. All right, let's go. So we're 0.5 to a town, and I'm gonna be honest, I'm feeling destroyed. I don't know if it was the lack of sleep or whatever, but um, so I'm gonna check to see if they have any rooms available. If there's any room in the inn, and if there is, then we'll take it as a sign. We'll, we'll stop here. If not, uh, we'll keep going another two and a half miles. Um, yeah, we'll see. All aboard the struggle bus. I'm struggling. I think there might be a place down the street. We're in La Sueña. Let's check. So finally found a place after like running around town and looking. And we went to four different places and they're all full. But I found the place for me and my wife. It's a private room. It's like all the gear everywhere. That's really nice. Um, this is Casa Tau. Uh, it's really nice. I ended up doing like 16 miles. So a little short than I wanted, but I my feet were really, really hurting. It's like I'm sunburnt. Even though it's like cloudy most of the day. Um, my feet were really hurt. There's just days that you just body just struggles. Usually it's a little bit further, but on day two, I'm really honest. I was having a tough time the last mm, hour only of the day, so that's not bad. Uh, I think it might be because it's been like four days since I haven't really slept, and we have like a nine, yeah, we, we're, where we live, it's like a nine hour time difference. So hopefully I'll get some good rest tonight. Tomorrow we're about six miles, I think. 
something like that, six or eight miles from Pamplona. Uh, we'll check that town out, get us SIM cards so we can get phones, we can actually call the hostels ahead of time, and then keep going. All right, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And also, if you have any questions, I've been long distance backpacking for like five years, hiked almost 5,000 miles. I'm not trying to brag, but I have knowledge and I want to share with you. If I want your Camino to be successful, I want, or maybe if you're planning to hike the Appalachian Trail, I love talking about the Appalachian Trail and Pacific Crest Trail. So if you ha guys have any questions, please put them in the comments and I'll uh, get to them. I'm trying to uh, check through it every day. So uh, yeah, so please subscribe and comment. All right, thank you. Have a good day.